Today is the American Federation of Teachers Washington Day of Action, where community and technical college faculty and students held walkouts across the state and flocked to the state capitol. Yeah, all calling on state lawmakers to reinvest in education as they're looking at the budget. CAPKV's Emily Goodell was at the walkout at Yakima Valley College this morning and spoke with union representatives about their concerns. They say they've been trying to reach out to state lawmakers for months now, and they've been using letters, showing up to Olympia to testify for education bills, all to no avail. That's why they decided to do their walkout today. What do we want? Funding for education. When do we want it? Now. We know enough about the budget by today that we know that we aren't getting some of the things we're asking for unless we take action. What do we want? Support for students. Funding to hire counselors and provide more services to help students. They may have financial challenges, homelessness, food insecurity, family or mental health challenges. For these students, focus on assignments and classes is hampered by the very real challenges they have to overcome just to get here, to get to campus and be in class. Teachers and students must unite! This is why we have to fight! They want the full amount of funding the state is required to provide to keep up with cost of living adjustments or COLAs. Right now the governor's budget funds 83% and the Senate budget funds 92% of the state mandated COLAs. The colleges have to take that money out of another program or ha have to cut staffing. What do we want? Equal pay! Adjunct faculty have the same advanced degrees in student loan debt and qualifications as full-time faculty, but because they're working part-time, their rate of pay is far less. We are losing people to K-12 because K-12 is paid something like 12 or 13% more. <laughs> Also pushing for a general salary adjustment, something faculty in Washington State haven't seen since 2009. Back then the state's economy was hurting. Now the state has money to support community colleges if they choose to. And it's time for the legislature to reinvest in our colleges. Education is a right! This is why we have to fight! We reached out to state lawmakers with the 14th district who were in session today and unavailable for comment. But if we do get some responses back from them, we'll continue to keep you updated with those at our website, yaktrynews.com. Reporting in Yakima, Emily Goodell, Cap Cave View, Local News.